Well, uh, evening. Oh, my day. I don't know where to start with this. I have no idea where to start with this. Um, yeah, we got fingered. Yeah, fingered by Brighton. Humbled, outclassed, embarrassed. Absolutely abysmal. Embarrassing. Bunch of schoolboys, bunch of bottle jobs. And uh, big up to Brighton as well. Deserved it. Absolutely battered us. Minute one to minute 90. We're here for the, for the live match reaction player ratings. Fan cams coming off this as well. Potentially for that. But before I start, thank you to everyone who watched the watch along. It was a lit watch along. Even, even though the game was fucking abysmal, it was a lit watch along. It was, it was a lit watch along. And uh, thanks to everyone who did watch. Really appreciate you guys' support as always. Make sure you are tuning in. Give me a like, share, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. But yeah, I'm going to try my best not to rant. Not, I'm, I'm not going to rant. I'm going to try my best. Keep it chill. I'm trying to stop the swearing on it and all that stuff. But what I just watched out there today was absolutely embarrassing. Embarrassing. It's embarrassing. How can anyone sit there and tell me, yeah, that we didn't bought this thing title? We, oh, we didn't bottle it. We fucking bottled it. We bottled it. We bottled it. Like, what, what, where do all these, these Arsenal fans get this thing from when we... Oh, we, but, but, but we didn't bottle it. We we challenged Man City. We was eight points clear. We was eight points clear, people. And people are happy that we challenged Man City. I saw a guy, right, on this Discord. I, I do not use Discord, yeah? I saw this last time on Discord saying... I prefer respect over a trophy. This guy on Discord said he preferred respect over a trophy. He prefers teams giving off respect over a trophy. Is he mad? Is he crazy right now? But like, we've been absolutely embarrassed and fingered, destroyed, whatever word you want to use, by Brighton. 3 0 at the Emirates. 3 0 at the Emirates Stadium, people. I don't believe it. I'm sorry. It's an embarrassment. It's an embarrassment. Every single one of the players should, should hand their heads in shame after that. Every single one of them should hand their heads in shame. What? I don't know. I, don't, I honestly have no words. I've got no words to explain what I've just watched there. We're, we're going to talk about the goals. We're going to talk about the game in general. We're going to go through your comments in a minute as well. Leave them all down below. We're going to go through player ratings and all that stuff. And uh, this is what we call the same old Arsenal people. Yeah? Same old Arsenal Year in, year out. When we all get our hopes up, it's, it's a cycle. We all get our hopes up. We, we all believe. We all back the team, back the players, back the team. Yeah, well, every single fan was leaving, so did they back the team? No, they didn't. So, yeah, we all get our hopes up and then we all go down. It happens every single season. I'm sick of it. I've seen it year in, year out. This is 19, 20 years it'll be now. 20 years that this football club have gone without winning a league title. 20 years. I've, I've only seen Arsenal win. FA Cups of Community Shields. 20 years we've been in this position of not winning the league title. And I'm sick of it now. Honestly, I'm sick of it. This was our best chance this season, yeah? Our best chance in a, in, in a long while. I, I sat back. I kept quiet, guys. You know you know, you, you know my thoughts on the, on, on, on the manager. I hold my hands up to the manager. I said I got it wrong about the manager. I said all that stuff, yeah? But look where we are now. Right? Yeah, we finished second. Well done. Yeah, we lost. We 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 won nothing this season. Zero trophies. Zero trophies. Finished second. You look you look at that as a perspective on elite level sport, and that is classed as a fail as a failure. That is elite level sport mentality as a failure. Right? Yeah, it's been a good season. Yeah, we've had some good moments. But when it really came down to the wire, when it really came down. To these players putting it in all to, to towards the end to challenge this man to just see so eight points clear, people. Eight points clear. I'm not, I'm not this game was shit, yeah. This game was fucking embarrassing. But I'm not going to this game. I will always go back and look at the games against Southampton and against um West Ham and against Liverpool, right? And against Man City, right? Right, forget about Liverpool, Southampton, whatever. Forget about Man City because you know we got battered. Southampton at the Emirates, yeah. 3-1 down. 3-1 down. Bottle jobs. West Ham, 2-1, 2 one bottle jobs. Liverpool, 2 one bottle jobs. Everton at Goodson Park, we, we lost that game. Brentford, 1-1. One, one. 
like I look back at those games and that's what cost us the the you know the league title. This game is uh just gives us an overall on that we did not deserve the league title whatsoever. And and Man City do it again. Man City winning the league title again, people. Manchester City winning it again. And I'm absolutely vexed, I'm fuming. Um and uh yeah, so let's get against this game though. Let's talk about the game, people. Starting off we, we we were poor for minute one to minute ninety, you know. Starting off, um, you know, right had a good chance from uh, that, and that's so guy from Paraguay. He's he, he's a good player to be fair. Um, sorry, I usually talk about the lineup, don't I? At, at least my left back was playing today. Yeah, big up my guy Tierney. At, at least Tierney was in the squad today. At least Kieran Tierney was in the squad today. At least my left back was in the squad today. People, right? Yeah, and I, and I saw that first twenty minutes against Matoma. Tierney had him in his pocket. The Zerbi knew about Ben White. The Zerbi knew to switch him around. They switch him around and it's peak, right? First half, nil-nil. Um, we hit the crossbar from Trossard. Martin goes off, uh, comes off injured. We, we we hit the post from Trossard. Odegaard has a good chance. Saka has a good chance. Uh, and Esso should have scored. M- Matoma crossed it in. Again, Ben White sleeping. I'm going to go to Ben White in a minute. I swear to God, this guy, man. Against Zol Pub as well. It's crazy. But yeah, second half. What, what was it at halftime? Please someone tell me what was said at half time. What was said at half time? One ball for, for their first goal. One ball over the top, people. One ball from Levi Colwell, right? Over the top. Ben White. Uh? Uh? Matomo just goes past him. Yeah? Ben White's standing there, trying to stand him up. But um, Matoma cuts back, cuts back him again. Ben White gets absolutely destroyed. It's a slip past the side. Say though, my left back Tierney, what are you doing, my friend? What are you doing, Tierney? He just heads it back to Sai and then goes over everyone's head. Key Ke- was on the floor. What's he doing on the floor? Gabriel's nowhere to be seen. It's a header, one nil. Schoolboy, abysmal Sunday league pub team type defending that was for their first goal. Embarrassing defending. One ball, one ball over the top, and we and they're in. And Ben White is playing against his former club. Probably still playing for them. Probably had a brand shirt. Probably still had a brand tattoo or whatever. Because it, 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 that, that was his performance today. Abysmal. Their second goal. Yeah, Trossard. It's so funny how both their goals. Well, so two of them goals came from ex Brighton players, isn't it? Oh yeah, fucking written in the stars, weren't that? Trossard, what are you doing, my friend? What on earth are you doing? And then, um, I don't um, Who scored? Endav, innit? What's his name? Is it Endav? I don't know how you pronounce the guy's name, right? But he's a B-Tech Mopai. He, he looks like Mopai. He's a B-Tech Mopai. He scores. R- Ramsar should have done better. Over Ramsar, 2 0 games over, done and dusted. Right? And then to wrap things up, again, shocking defending. S. Supian, you know, taps it in, 3 0, game over. We've been embarrassed. We've been humbled. Um, abysmal. I don't know what to say. People can complain the ref. Yeah, I agree. I don't blame the ref, but the ref is horrendous today. But I'm looking at it now and I'm thinking, fuck the ref. I don't care about the ref anymore. I care about this fucking defending, this performance. Honestly. Honestly, man. It's, it's a disgrace. It is a disgrace. You could not, by any way, shape, or form, go and perform like that against Brighton. Free, free. I don't believe it. I am vexed. I'm fuming right now, people. Right, the the league was done. People say, "Oh, we still got a chance." If it's it's over now, obviously, it was done weeks and weeks ago. Yeah, and I did say, people, you're negative. Go and support Spurs. You're, you're toxic, you're negative, because I said the league was done. Like, when the South Hunters came, I was like, the, the league's done, yeah? And I got called negative and toxic. Cool, cool, all right. What are they saying now? What are they saying now, right? I've been positive throughout this whole entire season. I said, it's Man United when we won 3-2. I said that I believe. I, I had the faith. For once in on this channel, I had the faith. People know how negative I am, right? But I had the faith. I had the faith that we would go 
for the first time in my life, I can see the football club win the Premier League trophy, win the Premier League title for the first time in my life. I had the faith. I got behind on top. I got behind the team. Right? I was positive throughout. But same old. It's the same old. I've seen it last season when we was not even in the title race. We back top four, right? Crystal Palace batted 3-0. Brighton, funny enough, beat us 2-1. Southampton beat us 1-0. Bottled that. Newcastle last season, 2-0. Tottenham last season, 3-0. Season before that, we knocked out by Villarreal in, in Europa League. Couldn't even win that. Talking about that, right? We got the Champions League next season. Oh, that's all great. Oh, yeah. Don't worry, because it's fine, because we, we, we can attract uh, better players with, with, with the Champions League. That's what, that's what I've heard, right? That's bollocks, right? Anyway, we got the Champions League next season, yeah? We better sign. In the summer, don't they do, yeah? You, you, it's all right if you want to smoke your cigar, right? Sign the elite players next season. Go and get that, that guy, Sai Salo, who played against us, who, who controlled and bossed us in, in the midfield. Go and get Sai Salo right now, ASAP. Call him up tomorrow and say, we, we want Sai Salo. We'll, we'll pay the fucking 80 million. Go and get him. Go and get Sai Salo right now. We need a player like him. Yeah, yeah, he's aggressive, but I want someone like that in my team. And we need we need a guy like that in our team who's aggressive, who fights for the badge, right? Who has a go. Do you know what I mean? Go and get Sai Salo. Go and get Declan Rice. 120 million, I don't care. Pay the money now, right? Go and get Declan Rice. We need an elite level players next season. Otherwise, Champions League, we're going to finish fourth. Yeah? we we Forget about third, we're going to get fourth. Right? We're going to win nothing next season if we act like this. Teams will get better next season. You know, teams will improve next season. This is why I'm saying this is the better, this is probably one of our best chances we've ever had in the Emirates era to win a league title. Right? It was one of our best chances. Next season, Man City will be up there. Liverpool, will, will, I'm sure, will be back and strengthen them in, in the summer. Man United will strengthen them in, in the summer. Newcastle will spend their money in the summer. You know, um, I don't know what's going on with Chelsea. Um, but, yeah. So, this is what I mean. This is what I mean, guys. This is where, where we're at now, where we won nothing this season. We finished second, runners-up. And uh, Man City just... The, the fact that we was eight points clear. People want to tell me that we, that we haven't bottled it. Right? This is Arsenal, right? We have bottled it. Right, look at this bottle. This is Arsenal. Okay, we, we, we have bottled it. We we have bottled it. People want to try and tell me we haven't bottled it. Oh, because I said we bottled it, I'm negative and toxic. We bottled it. Got eight points clear, right? And losing and joined to Southampton and joined to West Ham and joined to Liverpool and losing to Man City and losing to Everton and, and, and losing today. Yeah, that's called bottling, my friends. Right? Google the term bottling and you and you'll know what I mean. People, do you know what I mean? So, mate, we bottled it. We bottled it. I'm sorry. It's same year in, year out. Brian deserved the win today, you know, and they had one game plan. And this is what I was saying.